When you provide health benefits to your employees, you face many choices. You choose the insurance carrier. You choose the plan. You even choose the type of insurance financing. You could choose a fully insured program. If you're fully insured, your carrier assumes the risks and the liabilities that are associated with your employees' claims for a single year. The fact that you don't have month-to-month -month volatility might seem like a great deal, but the trade-off is that you have less control. You get no data and little input into your plan design. Premiums are bloated by taxes and carrier profits. Then your renewal increase arrives and you realize, in the end, you actually are paying those claims, and then some. And you find yourself caught in a vicious cycle, so you may turn to self-insurance. In self-insurance, you gain control, but you cover your own claims. A third-party administrator takes care of everything your carrier used to, like providing a PPO network, ID cards, enrollment, and so on. And because you're not pre-funding claims in the form of an insurance premium, your cash flow improves. But since you're paying the claims, you'll need some protection. You'll start by buying specific stop loss, which protects you from large claims. When catastrophe strikes and an exceptionally large claim occurs, stop loss will pay the claim on your behalf. You'll also buy aggregate stop loss, which caps the total amount of smaller claims you pay in a year. So even if everyone gets swine flu, your bank account can still weather the storm. Put those together and you're invincible, right? Well, not entirely. Stop loss policies only provide coverage for a year, but health conditions don't always resolve in a year. When the second year rolls around, something called a laser eliminates second year coverage for employees who have large, ongoing conditions. So the cost shifts back to you. Stop loss policies can also have yearly premium increases upwards of 50%. And soon, you're right back where you started with insurance that doesn't help you when you need it most and costs far too much. But there's another way to protect yourself, a captive. Members of a captive are like-minded employers focused on containing the rising cost of healthcare benefits. All members of a captive put money into a claim stabilization pool. That pool is shared with other employers enrolled in the program and together, they all own the pool. If combined claims are low in a given year, the stop-loss carrier refunds unused stop-loss premiums to the pool. If claims are high, the stop-loss carrier draws from the pool. The pool goes up or down based on the overall performance of the stop-loss premiums. And the amount contributed by each employer is always capped. So if the pool is ever empty, it's up to the stop-loss carrier to pay any additional claims. If you experience a terrible claims year, your fellow captive members will carry you. The following year, you may be helping to balance the bad claims year of one of your peers. In this way, the captive ensures year-over-year -year stability, and stop-loss renewals are based on the experience of the group as a whole, so you won't experience the wild premium increases that come with being self-insured on your own. In the end, you'll get all the control that comes with self-insurance without the unexpected roadblocks that could slow you down. Learn more about captives at ParetoCaptive.com and choose the path for employee benefits that actually benefit everyone.